YouTube, BST here by SP Tech, and this is the Galaxy S20 Ultra, of course, One UI 5. This is the second beta. I already did a video yesterday covering all the new things, showing them, I think, in a very detailed and explicit way, and then, of course, also did an animation test. But I discovered that things with the second One UI. 5 beta 2 are not so bad and I also got indications from people that um, view my channel like Vic and others that apparently animations get better. I just want to show you something guys so that you know there is no manipulation. I am using my phone with the motion smoothness which means that I'm getting 120 Hertz and also WQHD resolution. All right. So in this video I want to specifically test the animation. Also, there was a request saying, hey, how can you shoot animations videos 4K 30 FPS? Well, all right, this video is going to be 60 FPS, so enjoy the animations, enjoy the fluidity or the stutter, which is going to be, we're going to find out. And if you're here for the first time, you like the ukulele or the gaming, why not subscribing for my channel, guys? That's the least you can do. Thank you very much and let's start. All right, so the first thing is going to be me popping up the lock screen and of course then testing the unlock. Now have in mind that I do have a glass, so I'm using the Panzer and it was very bad, you know, before, before the beta 2, this was very bad. I was really so frustrated and there is something very important missing, like this is the touch sensitivity. I'm not sure if this is back already. Oh my God, it is back already. The touch sensitivity, guys, was not there in the first beta okay so right now increase the touch sensitivity of the screen for use with screen protectors i really hope to get even better yeah uh, pff, this is really flawless right now there were some folks asking me why i didn't bought the white domain etc well i went with the panzer glass and i'm not disappointed guys you can just see it unlocks every time and we can now confirm that the increasing of the touch sensitivity is back in one UI, all right? So, so far, guys, so good. It's very smooth, really, and you know, luck and stutter has been one of the problems that are plaguing this else beautiful device. And I don't wanna sound like somebody who like nitpick things. The whole thing is that this is the premium, right? This is the best, all right? And I know I use the Z Clip 4 and the fold is there, but this still is the best of the best, best display, we have the S Pen, we have the best camera, so this is still the best pack for me. But okay, enough talking guys, now let's check the animations. There is one particular animation driving me crazy, and Jesus, you know, probably guys, I have to lay a hand on my heart, probably the first time I see this animation running on my S22 Ultra, 120 Hz, WQHD+, and no starter at all. This is well, I'm now gonna go right to access Google. Boom! I mean, have you seen that? I'm like, did you see this, guys? Really crazy. This was not so smooth before, and I'm just gonna keep doing this the fastest I can, so you can just see and experience this on 4K 60 FPS, which actually Marcus forbid me to shoot on. Right, you know, 24 and 30 FPS all the way, but okay, this time I'm doing this exception. So confirmed, these animations are flawless, all right? I'm, I don't know what is happening with the latest August firmware that hopefully, you know, is improving the camera and the HDR is back and etc. Um, that I have some indications that this made its way in the second One UI 5 Beta 2. It is really crazy, crazy good, guys. Is this it? I really hope so. Yesterday, you know, when I just used it for one day, it was not the case. Then I left my phone the whole night and now, boom, this is what we have. Now let's try to access my notifications. See that? Flawless, right? This is what they say, it's flawless, guys. See? Everything works perfect, okay? There is not a problem with anything. I mean, you can just go there and you can just do whatever you want. See, it's all so fluid. Okay, let's just also go and access the volume rocker, all right? Everything up and running, so smooth, you see? Not a problem at all. Weather is starting the application, see here. Absolutely fantastic, guys. And by the way, the animation is absolutely crazy. See what happens, guys, here. See, just memorize here the star, opening the weather, boom. 
you have this very nice beautiful animation going down like this and see it the way my background pops in and pops out and this is why i love samsung one ui this is why we love one ui it is really a pleasure to the eye you know to use it let's check now how the camera performs opening the camera the focus enhancer is back guys this was missing from the first better one of one ui 5 now it's back and oh my god i'm so pleased to see that one and yep it does really work so the focus enhancer definitely there you can just see guys it is doing its thing it is changing the lenses right let's also try to go to the portrait mode let's go here to the front camera okay back camera let's go to photo let's go to video right back camera front camera now let's try to exit the camera application boom very fluid by the way opening the camera right closing the camera opening the camera closing the camera opening the camera closing the camera now is the time for you to be laughing like mad at me but i'm just doing my thing guys it is what it is it is just working better right and probably since two or three months i can say this is not a placebo guys this is not a placebo this really works better and now let's just try to do some of the first tests wow all right usually after heavy operation this will really fail now let's go to the right to enable google boom very quick and instant guys home screen navigation all right 60 fps android video notifications okay let's just go and access the wallpaper and styles right now let's check the recent menu okay recent menu boom so many i have thousands of applications okay one more time all right one more time crazy crazy right i'm gonna close though okay and now guys i'm gonna open the folder right see boom boom very quick let's open telegram right exit let's open messenger right open exit let's open facebook open exit let's open instagram all right yes open exit let's open snapchat okay let's open snapchat all right let's just go here check boom it's so quick let's just try to change the cameras yeah, it is quick. Let's close Snapchat. Snapchat was doing these crazy things, you know, with delays. Now let's go Viber. Boom. Open. Yeah, I don't have a SIM card there. Boom. Close. Now let's open TikTok. Okay. I hate this app, but I have it for testing purposes. All right. Many things there. Okay. Not now. Okay. Wow, 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 wow. Exit. No lag at all. Let's open Twitter, guys. The most slowly working application let's refresh it okay yeah i think even twitter is better twitter is better twitter of on android better this is really like a miracle but the most important part guys see here opening so many apps right no starter at all and this was a bad thing for samsung i still have my case though on now let's open spotify takes a lot of time to load nothing changed still but then see guys see I'm not sure I experienced this animation in a whole other different way. I'm not sure. I didn't really change anything in my transitions. I didn't change anything in my animation settings, in my developer settings, nothing. It just really like stuck. Let's try to open YouTube, okay? Open YouTube, right? Let's just do this magic thing there. Oh my God. Can you see this, by the way? So flawless, okay? This is really, really flawless. Let's open home. Okay, I got home now. Let's also minimize it. Now I have two minimized applications. Um, can you see this, by the way, it's worth like crazy. And yesterday, something, guys, that I realized yesterday. Let's open the camera, right? Let's open the camera. And let's try to minimize the camera as well. And you know what, guys? See, this is absolutely crazy. And I realize sometimes I'm not very fond of Samsung. But what they did here is absolutely crazy. Because I was thinking that like this preview in real time would have not worked here see in kind of like a mode like this like in a standalone pop that window but it does work it does work and it feels fantastic now i'm going to minimize everything no lag at all okay let's open spotify let's go there let's open spotify let's minimize spotify okay let's open mixcloud okay let's now also minimize mixcloud how many apps do we have here right we have a lot of applications let's just minimize everything and we have one two three four but that's not enough that's not enough so let's now go and open twitter i'm gonna minimize twitter as well all right let's open tiktok let's minimize tiktok as well okay i'm not sure if it's gonna work let's try to minimize tiktok as well okay 
TikTok minimized. How many apps do we have, guys, there? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let's open. Twitter is already minimized. Let's open Telegram. Let's minimize Telegram as well. I'm not sure if that's going to work. Okay, can use this app in a multi-window, right? I don't really care. Now, let's open Chrome. Let's try to minimize Chrome. Can we minimize Chrome? I think we can. How many apps do we have, guys? Crazy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven apps, right? Let's open them one by one, okay? Even, even things like this will just cause some very minimal, very minimal stutter, guys. How is this possible? This was not the case before, I can tell you. This was not the case before, I'm sure. And even now, guys, okay, can open more than five. All right, now let's open the camera and we can still see my input and I can move it around and there is like almost no luck and I'm doing this video 60 FPS because you wanted 60 FPS. Now let's check this animation. Let's check this animation, all right? Let's shake it. Let's shake it. Flawless. Google, flawless. Scrolling, flawless. All right, Abdor, flawless. Searching, flawless. Let's get go now inside. Uh, go now inside my settings, guys. Scroll everything. It's just flawless. All right. Uh, maybe, maybe a bit. Uh, maybe there was like like a small stutter there. Okay, flawless. I think Samsung are on the right way with the. S22 Ultra add with One UI 5. I really hope also that Android 12 with the One UI 4.1.1 is also getting better. Let me know what do you think down below in the comments. It was really a pleasure for me to do this video for you guys. The respect for watching this channel, guys. And if you're here for the first time, don't forget to subscribe. Stay safe, you and your families. Eat some candy and meet you soon. VST over and... Bye.